Hello, Fear the Meerkat here, welcome to another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy V Advance. Now, I recorded, uh, I started recording this last night, but um, something went wrong, basically. But yes, I know that we can't go and get Lana, because I already tried that and it didn't work, but this way has been opened up for us and what we need to do is go into this cave. Now, without Lena, I don't have white magic and I don't have items. I'm not really sure how I'm going to deal with that because I didn't really get that far, if you see what I mean, uh, whilst I was trying to record it yesterday. But I do at least know that uh, I need to go into this cave and... Um, well, if I need to turn one of my characters into a white mage, I guess I will. I'm just hoping that won't be necessary. I'll uh, play it by ear, as it were. Uh, okay, Gahido. Ali Ho. That's that's where I chose to pronounce that. Oh, thank you. I suppose I can. Be, you can be helpful after all. The shock of the two worlds merging sent everything topsy-turvy, including me. A bit too old to do much on my back, I room. What do you mean, worlds merging? I guess you're just as slow on the outtake as before. It's an ancient legend, but I'd never imagined it was true. According to legend, a thousand years ago, Bart's world and Kral's world won the same. The same? It seems there's quite the echo in here. But why did the world split? To seal the void. Void? I fear, no matter how often I allude to ignorance, my dry wit just goes over your head. So I will simply explain. I really like Gehido. One thousand years ago, there existed a presence of the strongest evil. Inu, e Eno, as as I'm choosing to pronounce it. Inu possessed the power to control the void. After a long and harrowing battle, the people were able to defeat Inu with the twelve legendary weapons. However, the void that Inu had created could not be arranged. Yes, I know it's probably not pronounced Inu, but I'm pronouncing it that way anyway, because I have no way of knowing otherwise. As the last resort, the people split the crystals into two. To maintain balance, the world well split into two as well. The void was sealed within the space between the two worlds, the interdimensional rift. That means that stuff was telling the truth. He really did want to return the world how it used to be. However, without the crystals, the wind's power will never return. Nor will that of the earth, fire or water. Ow! This splinter really hurts. See, I knew that wasn't just a splinter. Th this is very bad. The splinter can float. It's turned into extra. Extra! <laughs> I turned myself into a tiny splinter. Yes, waiting for this moment. Now you can understand my true goal is to take the sealed power of the void for my own. What? Why do you think I merged the two worlds together? <laughs> Oh, now that the two worlds are one, the interdimensional rift, the void was sealed with them is appearing as well. Wait, so in plain English, you're saying this void, whatever not, is coming here? Yes, the void shall be released when it's sound in the airport and into my keeping. The matchless power of the void be mine. 
Not a chance, like Steph. Kaido's on his back again, it's not good. See, why can't X stuff do this before when we were fighting him? That's what I don't understand. Castle Tycoon. Lena! So she shouldn't have been partying too much. So much. And now she's gone. If we had been allowed to go and, and get her and bring her with us, then she wouldn't have been trapped in the void or whatever. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look. Gaze upon the unlimited power of the void. What as it engulfs all in its power? And soon it will belong to me. Lana, Exta, you. Seriously, why didn't you do this to us before? Peons. I don't know what the word means. Tremble before my might. <laughs> Time for your vice area to see the light of day. Now die. I don't know what a vice area is either. Turtle. Not bad for a reptile. You think I sat around eating pizza for seven centuries? Or something along those lines on that misread it slightly? Ha! <laughs> Perhaps you should have taken the chance. You should find no such tasty diversions in the afterlife. How does that stuff know? I mean, it hasn't been in the afterlife. It could be made of pizza for all he knows. Shouldn't make assumptions like that about pizza. Peons, tremble before my might. <laughs> well, I hope he didn't hit his head on the ceiling. Actually, I hope he did. I mean, it's a cave. It will have a ceiling. Ah, oh, my aching... Kaido, you okay? Axtaf, that car. It must be stopped before he obtains the full power of the void or... Huh? By Jove, what's that? Just the I Library of the Ancients. The fabled Library of the Ancients? My dear boy, have you any idea what an important place that is? Uh, of course you don't. To think that the Library of Ancients was here the whole time. Fall close, student. Within the library is a book which describes how to defeat Exdeath. I wish we'd known that before. So he's Gahido. Ah, sc scholars from the Sergei. We've been able to find the second half of the seal tone. Perfect. Now, this makes me wonder, did they find the first half centuries ago? I've forgotten. I'm sure there was an explanation in the guy the first time in the library of the ancients, but I don't remember what. Now, let us begin the strategy meeting. As you probably noticed, the two worlds have been recombined into one. Actually, if you go back to Castle Tycoon, or if you just sort of explore around for a while before going into the cave with Kaido in it, you will find the big bridge, which of course should be in world uh, 2. So, yes, it is possible to notice that. Also, the void is trying to break free from where it has been sealed within the rift. Then we better hurry though and stop it. Barts, barts, barts. So enthusiastic and yet so stupid. Along with the void, many fearsome monsters were sealed in the rift a millennia ago. 
They are all incredibly evil and incredibly strong. I feel safe in saying, as you are now, you kids won't stand a chance. Then what do we do? Elementary, my dear Bart. The legendary weapons used to defeat the warlock, Eno, a thousand years ago. Legendary weapons? Sometimes I wonder if you say things like this to spite me. Yes, the twelve legendary weapons. They are weapons. They are legendary. There are even twelve of them. Now that we are both paths of the sealed tomb, if it all goes according to Lazarus, and I'm certain it will, the book will show us the way. It is written, when nothing's power again does beat, to light warriors this book shall speak. The book begins to speak. I, I know that wasn't technically dialogue, but I'm going to assume this bit is the book actually speaking, is there for dialogue I should read. After Inu's defeat, the weapons of Lezend were sealed within the castle of Kuza. To break the seal, four tablets must be assembled. One west longs hide the spirits of the past, blessed by the soil. One west within an island shrine, kissed by wind. One west beneath the ocean's floor, engulfed by flames. One west beyond the river's torrent, protected by water. All of which is quite unfortunate, since earth, fire, wind and water don't really exist anymore. Anyway... Along with the keys to open the seals, the four tablets, our sealed our servants. If the tablets are moved, our servants will awaken. The ultimate spells are black and white, the magic of time and space, Meteor, the seal king Leviathan, and the dragon king, the Hamut. Present this book onto the gate, and the way to the seals will be revealed. Go, unseal the Trail of Lazenby weapon before X Death gains the power of the void. We are all counting on you. Go and find the first tablet, blessed by the soil and the spirits of the past. Eureka! It must be the pyramid in the desert of shifting sands. Prowess, Prowl, and even you, Barts. You must go at once, the future of the world depends on it. Now, that was a whole lot of talking, and there's nothing else to really see in the library. Um, I'm probably not going to be fighting a lot of these battles. Um, I'm sure there are some coming up. Just because I don't really have magic anymore, I might be able to buy some items, but I rather suspect that if we're going into the pyramid, there's going to be a boss as well, so I'll probably need all my energy for that. I am hoping that a white mage and a white magic won't be needed. We'll see, I guess. Um, from this point on, I'm kind of going uh, going along this blind here, so... But yeah, we're going to get out of here and uh, actually get on with stuff other than just me talking. There are other things I can go and get as well, now that I can I have access to some parts of uh, World 1 again, but I'm not going to get them now, because we don't really have suitable transport or white magic, so... Okay, this is probably going to be useful. Wait a moment. Alright, unless there's something new to see here, I'm probably not going to say anything except maybe talk about any items I buy here. All the scores went to the building that appeared in the south. Actually, I'm not sure it's necessary for me to read dialogue either. 
I am just going to look for um, somewhere I can buy stuff, and that's going to be it. So, uh, I suppose I will see you in a minute. Oh, well, some here, actually. Um, I might as well sell all of these things that you can drink. Because it turns out the drink command is for one specific job type, and it's not a job type that I'm intending to ever use. And there are much more helpful things I can uh, buy, so... And chemists, actually, aren't isn't a very useful job type either, so... Alright, I'm hoping the shifting sands are down here. I'm just gonna skip battles, because I don't want to get hurt. I know doing this is fairly boring, but... Ah, this wasn't here before. I guess this is part of merging. The Guardian Tree. I'm sorry, I thought all of the uh, talking was over. Oh well. The Force is beginning to come back to life. Grandpa. Why can't Grandpa come back to life? Lana. Papa. So many lives have been lost. We must stop X death. The people around the world need us. Not only the people, but all life. I. So many sacrifices have been made already. I won't stand by while more lives are lost. Let's go. So there won't be any more sacrifices. Okay, game. We get that it's important for us to defeat X death. Okay? You don't have to keep on mentioning it so many times. The sand stopped moving. I'm not sure that's a good thing. I guess now that both sets of crystals have shattered, there's not enough power in the air for it to move. Even the ground is, un is getting unstable. Unstable and yet staying perfectly still. I'm not really sure that's what causes sand to shift, but never mind. Actually, just before I do that, I should have gone to the inn instead of having to use one of these, but never mind. Rather strange, it's the same size as the pyramid. As is Box. I'm not sure how I'm going to handle the inside of the pyramid in regards to. Uh, things being... Oh, okay. I'm gonna have to fight these things. In regards to, um... Alright, I don't really have time to, uh... mess around with just attacking uh, physically here. I'm just gonna have to make a guess about uh, how to destroy them and the what I use because the magic I use is to heal them instead. This works well against most things. Yep. Just hoping that uh, they can't hurt me that much. At least they seem to be using mostly physical attacks, which means Gollum is probably going to get rid of them. At least that could have can attack both. So yeah, I don't want to show a bunch of, uh, a lot of me just uh, running off from battles, basically, 
this hard look for wing for you, so I'm not quite sure how I'll handle that. Now uh, they come they come back, that's unfortunate. Well that worked temporarily. I guess I have a limited amount of time. Yeah, they do come back, I'm guessing, but uh, only after a certain amount of time. Look, the sealed tome! Blessed by the soul and the spirits of all, one temple tablet rests. Okay, so we can go in now. But I'm going to take the rest and, uh, yeah, use the cottage. Because those ethers might be much more helpful than that. I'll have fewer cottages left, but. Now then, I don't know how large this pyramid is, I'm not going to have it in it, so I don't know how far I'm going to get, but I might as well have a few more minutes on this, uh, playing this since I've had a lot of short episodes recently. Plus, I'm sure you want something more interesting than just me talking. It might be possible for me to come back here. Oh, hmm. I'm not sure if I'm skipping over getting any items or not. It might be a good idea to cast float unless I, I don't have float. Float time magic. I don't know why I'm asking. There's there's no way for you to tell me. Ah, there we go. Normally when there's a monster inside there's also something else. Alright, let's let's see if we can get rid of these. I don't think I, I can run away from this battle. Uh, that's a nice name. Damned. If I'm not going to be fighting a lot of creases, I probably actually shouldn't be too wary about using um, powerful magic. I'm hoping that I can go back through here so that I'm not, uh, so that I can redo these battles, if you see what I mean.
Well, the only character who can use that shield is him. Um, he already has a shield. But yeah, I do want to fight all of these battles. I just want to do them later when it's more suitable. Ah, okay. There were three buttons like that earlier that I could have used instead of float. Well, as a trap, that was pretty tame, to be honest. On the other hand... Okay, not fighting anything else unless I genuinely have to. That didn't even get me an item. Well, it got me one item, but then again I have to use that item straight away, so... Okay, I'll see you in a minute once I get back to the right place. Well, those other two are probably monster attacks as well. And you know what? I, due to timing constraints, I think now is actually a good time to end the episode. I will see you next time.